on three, yoga. One, two, three, yoga! <laughs> Hooray, let's go back to our mats and do some of it already. Good job, yogi. Good job. <clears throat> yeah. Now as you come back, as you come back to your mat, make a fist. Make two fists, one on each hand. Roll the fingers in. Thumbs always go on the outside of the fist. They go on the inside. You break your thumb when you have to punch someone. Thumbs stay out. Good. Well done. Now take them down to the mat. Do high plank, please. Fist down. This will help save your wrists a little bit. A little warm up as you warm up gently from the inside out. You defied me already. I said, put your fist down. You put your hands down. If you did it on purpose, then keep it. If you did it as a habit, then examine it. And don't be afraid to try something different, especially in here. Don't be afraid to be bolder, to be more accepting, to be more loving. When I came to yoga, I was a cage fighter, an MMA cage fighter. Jack, what are you doing? You're doing push-ups already. There's fucking hundreds of those coming, buddy. You stay right there. You fucking breathe, man. That's yoga. Yoga can be characterized as such. Put yourself in a horribly uncomfortable position and then just fucking breathe there. <laughs> Do your best there. Do your best to accept the steady stream of this moment right here. Breathe in and breathe out. Yeah, and if it doesn't feel good to you, put your hands down. Exactly. Just be aware of the options there. Be unafraid to try. Be willing to try. Breathe in and out. Inhale and exhale. Accept it right here, right now. This is what's happening. Breathe in and out. You got it, yogis. Here for five. Strong and steady for four. Three. Yeah, that's it. You can always drop to one knee or the other. Two. Make it your own. This moment is yours. Last one. Breathe in. Down dog. Take the hips high. Plant the hands down flat. Fan the fingers wide. Let the head and neck hang heavy, especially if any tension's crept in. Expressing itself on the outside. Nod out the head and neck a couple big times. Lift it up and then let it drop. Easy. Yeah. You inhale. And then let the head hang heavy like a bowling ball on the end of a string. That's it, Jack. Breathe in. And out. Press actively through the arms so the body starts to resemble a capital A. Inhale. <laughs> Megan, close that curtain for me so I don't fry someone's eardrums. My God. Inhale. And exhale. Fill up. Breathe in. One more time. Take it. And give it back. Hinge forward, high plank, and lower and do a low push-up. Hold here and hover here. Hover here and hold here and grow a greater appreciation for high plank here. <laughs> Press straight up, and now go again, lower. And now push up. Yeah, lower and go. And notice how you grow an appreciation for going a little bit quicker now, don't you? Here for three, nothing happening that's weird, just a push-up. Here for two, here for one. Press up. And back to downward facing dog. Breathe in and out. Take in and get back. Fill up and offer ha. One more time. Take in and sigh ha. And now fill up and go. Take that wound to high plank and do what you got to do, yogis. Right here. And now, breathe and move or hold steady. Press down with the hands or with the fists. You do you, yogis. That's what this is all about. Do your best and give your brightest. For five. For four. Big finish. Three. Last two. Last one. Push up. Push back. Breathe in. And go. Let me hear you go. God damn it, take in 
and celebrate. Go! That's it. Look forward and travel forward. Top of map. Ragdoll. Oh, you earned that. Well done, yogis. Well done. Breathe in and out. Take in and give back. Fill up and offer. Release the hands to the mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Press into the toes or the shins. Really press actively so you feel the shoulder blades squeeze on the back. Good. Breathe in. Forward fold. Breathe out. You inhale. And exhale. Again, lift up halfway. Inhale. And fold. Exhale. All the way up. Mountain pose. Up, up, up. Open the heart, offer it up. Back bend, cactus the arms. Stay here, inhale. Stay here, exhale. If you move because you're touching someone, move back so that you are. Breathe in and out. You heard me. Is there some confusion? Move back so you are. So you're colliding in to another yogi. Oh my God. Oh no. Oh shit. What might happen? Breathe in, connect with them, make it happen, and out. I'm talking to you, damn it. Touch her right there. She's right next to you. Breathe in. Together, back bend. Offer it up. We're stronger as one. Reach high. Inhale. And fold low. Exhale. Well done. Halfway lift. Plant the hands and flow. High to low. Inhale. Up dog. Roll over the toes. Chest, chin, forward. Unless you got a fresh pedicure. Some of you saw my video this week. If you got a fresh pedi like I did, stay on the tips of the toes. Not the tops of them, okay, Ryan? Breathe in. Downward facing dog. Breathe out. You will prolong the lifeline of that pedicure by at least 90 days, I assure you. The inhale, look forward. And exhale, travel. Top of mat. Halfway lift. Breathe in. And fold. Time to move. Reach high. Mountain pose. Open the heart. Time to give. Offer it. Reach high. And fold low. Halfway and flow. Plant the hands. Step or jump back. Lower halfway. Open the heart. Up dog. Open the mind. Down dog. Hips high. Take it. And go. Look forward and jump. Top of mat. Halfway. Fold. Stand tall. Open the heart. Be bold. Reach high. And fold. Halfway. Flow. Up and down. One thing at a time. Present, look forward. Travel, top of mat. Halfway and fold. Reach high. Back bend. Reach and fold. That's it. Halfway lift and flow. Open and offer. Look forward. And travel together halfway. Fold. Reach and offer. Breathe and surrender. Inhale and exhale. Up and down and round and round we go. One more trip through, yogis. Take it. Together. Away. Breathe and move. Yeah. Don't make it harder than it has to be. Be present. Clear. Meet and down dog as you're done. Breathe in and out. Take in and give back. Fill up and offer high. Inhale and go. Look forward and travel. Top of Halfway lift, fold, sink the hips into a deep squat. We call it Utkatasana. We do a couple things weird here at Outlaw Yoga. We call a deep squat Utkatasana. We do that weird here. We demand that you turn your cell phones off. We do that weird here. I don't even demand that you face fucking forward. You face whatever direction you want. 
All I ask you to turn your cell phone off. It's not a lot. <laughs> but it is weird. I'm also going to ask you to give more, sink an inch deeper. I'm also going to ask you to breathe deeper. I'm going to ask you to be inspiring by accepting that which is greatest and that which is darkest within you. Breathe. Deep. Doesn't have to be cute. Just take it in. Lots of oxygen. There's lots of fuel for the muscles. A lot of peer pressure on you, though, huh? Sink deeper. And they will, too. See what you do? See what you're capable of, Yogi? Sink deeper. And they will, too. See, it happens. It works. Sink deeper. Give more. And someone else next to you will, too. I promise you. Breathe in. And out. Take in. And give back. Three more. You got this. Yes, you can. Two big breaths. One more. Fold low. Well done, Yogi's. Holy shit. Wu is right. Halfway. Inhale. Crow pose. Plant the hands. Bend the knees a lot. Bring them each to the back of the arm. High up into the armpit as you can get them. Hinge forward to make a shelf of the upper body. Lift up one foot and then the other. When you get there, hug the knees, or rather the heels towards your body, and then shoot the legs back to low plank. Yeah, buddy, I saw that. Up dog and down dog, it's just that easy. Breathe in, and drop down as you breathe out. Drop down, drop down, drop down, drop down. First time crows, any first time crows? Downward facing dog, downward facing dog. Down, oh now everyone's got questions. Down dog, come on, come on, come on. Breathe in, and out. Inhale, and exhale, breathe in, and breathe out, take in, and sigh, ha, that's it, lift the right leg high, don't miss this moment, step it through, low lunge, reach it high, crescent, don't miss this moment because you're too busy fucking thinking about it. Just immerse yourself in it. Trust yourself. You are magnificent. Breathe in. Open the heart. Back bend. Reach high. Hands to the heart. Hinge forward and twist to the right. Left elbow hooks the outside of the right knee. That's it. Stack the palms and the elbows as best you can in one perpendicular line to the mat. Use that gentle torque to rotate the left lung up towards the ceiling, then let the gaze follow. Up. Out. Brightness and brilliance follows presence and discipline. Breathe in and out. Inhale. Exhale. Slowly. Crescent lunge. Reach high. Unwind with grace. Grace. And open up. Warrior two. Grace doesn't mean you can fly like Michael Jordan. Some of you remember him. LeBron James. Doesn't mean that you are the most athletic, it means that you are the most grateful in any given moment. Gratitude, grace, go hand in hand, breathe in and out. Inhale and exhale. Lunge as low as you dare, breathe in, that's it. And out, that's it, inhale and exhale. One more, take in and give it back. Straighten the leg, triangle, reach forward, arms to 6 and 12. And instead of letting the right hand just dangle, press it down actively into something. Press it palm down into the shin, for example. And feel that engagement travel and ripple up through the rest of the upper body. Do you feel that? Now from there, open the heart. Take it back like you're on the cover of a romance novel someone there waiting to catch. Inhale and exhale. That's it. Star. Let the left hand lead you high. Up, up, up. Shiny and bright. Breathe in. Open the heart. Offer it. Perfect. Just as you are. Reach high. Horse. Sarah, get your butt up here and sink low. Show that half of the room how to do this. Breathe in and out. Inhale and exhale. Sink to parallel, no deeper. If you need to find some movement, do, and then settle in and breathe deeper. 
call in the oxygen, the medicine, the fuel for your success. Right here. The fuel for your presence. Right now. All you have to do is this breath. He will feel me eventually. Sink low and breathe deep. Take it up, Marco. Right here. Stay. When you want to run, stay. When you want to quit, stay. Breathe in and out. Stay low, but reach high. Inhale. Bring it down and go rah, as you exhale. Rah, again. Rah, and again. Rah, faster. Rah, fiercer. Rah, together. Rah, up the mountain. Rah, Five. Rah, four. Rah, three. Rah, two. Rah, one. Rah, start. Warrior two. Reverse. And flow through. Up dog. Come on. And down dog. Breathe in. And go. Woo! Again, take in. And celebrate. Go. Woo! One more time. Let me hear you. Fill up. And go. Woo! Left side. Lift it high. Step it through. Crescent. Reach on. Open your heart like you believe in your own brilliance. Reach up. Hands to the heart. Hinge forward and twist to the left. Breathe in. And out. Inhale. And exhale. Fill up. And offer up. Grace, gratitude personified. Inhale, unwind, crescent. Exhale, warrior two, open wide. Breathe steady. Take it. And get back. That which is best. Inside. Got this. You can do this. Right here. Right now. Present. Powerful. Straighten the leg. Triangle. Lean and reach. Press down. In order to reach high. From a stable base, your boldest expression yet. Inhale and exhale. Fill them and offer up. Take it and give it back. Inhale and ex. Reach high to star. Take it up, 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 yogis. Open the heart. Offer it. To reach high and sink into horse. It's time. It's time. It's time. It's time to do our best. This planet's dying. It's time to do better together. Breathe in and out. It's time to dig deeper. It's time to push forward. Take it in. And give it back. Call it in. And offer it up. Keep breathing. Close the eyes. Go with it. And see that quality that lies inside you. Your best. Your most brilliant. We need that. It is time, Yogi. Stay low. But reach high. Breathe in. And come out. Ah! Again. Ah! Loud. Ah! Let him hear you. Ah! And hear you. Ah! Around the street. Ah! And down. Ah! Around the state. Ah! And around the planet, five, four, three, two, one, star, warrior two, reverse, 
and release. Slow through. Up dog. And down dog. Breathe in. And out. Fill up. And go. Hinge forward to high plank. Hold here or lower halfway. Hold here or press up. Breathe and move. Make this moment your own. Whatever you choose, we're halfway there. Push. Big finish coming. Big finish coming. Big finish. Leave it all here, yogis. Last five. Last four. Three more. Two. And one. Downward facing dog. Breathe in. And out. Take in. And give it back. Fill up and go. Woo! Look forward and travel. Top of mat. Halfway lift. Fold. Mountain pose, reach up, 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 up. Open the heart, be bold. Reach high, hands to the heart. Close the eyes, breathe it, and clear it. Take it, and give it. Fill up, and offer. Open the eyes. Tree pose, left foot down, right foot high. Right foot to the calf, the inner thigh, maybe a kickstand. Set your gaze on one unmoving point. Set your gaze on one unmoving point. Set your gaze and fix your sight, yogis, on one unmoving point in your life. Obsess over it, and you will accomplish it. And if you're waiting for permission to be expressive, you're going to be waiting a long time. If you're waiting for permission to grow, to reach and shine. You're going to be waiting a really long fucking time. You must take it. Breathe in. And out. Make it. Your own. One more time. Breathe in. And release. Release it. Hands to the heart. Foot to the mat. Close the eyes. Take in. And give back. Breathe in. And breathe out. Do the other side, Sarah. bright from inside what are you waiting for reach high up 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 offer and shine wait no more breathe in and out take it and give back fill up release and sigh ha Hands to the heart, foot to the mat. If you move so you weren't colliding with someone, then move back. Turn around, please. 
Get within arm's reach of the person next to you. You might have to move a little bit and bring your partner with you. Megan, jump in and fill that gap. Yes, we need some communication. See, you might need some too. Good. Close enough to touch, not smell this time. That's oh, my spot. That's Get the fuck out of here. That's my man. Don't touch anybody. Not yet. Come into tree pose with the right foot up. Don't reach out when you're wobbly. Don't reach out and give less than your best. Wait until you are steady. Then reach out. Capture the person's upper back, their arm responsibly. Once you have connected, see how powerful we are together and close your eyes. An unbroken chain. See how powerful, how high we can fly together. Keep your eyes closed, open the heart. See what we are capable of. Breathe in and out. Don't wait. The time is now. We need you, each and every one of you, together for three, as one for two, high as we can for one. Stand up, release, and hug someone. Give someone a big hug, yogis. And then hug someone else, yogis. Get uh, some on you. Get some on you, yogis. Yeah. Yeah. And then hug someone else, yogis. Connection's the medicine we all need. We all need it. We all need it. And when you feel complete, come back to your mat. And get in that great tight line with the people next to you. The people that used to be so separate and different from you. This time the right foot down, the left foot high. Wait. Wait until you are stable. I cannot say it enough times. Don't serve with an empty cup. Fill your cup up, and when you're stable and able, reach out. You'll be more great of service, more successful in your steps. Close the eyes. Yeah, don't wait. Don't wait to wobble a little bit so that together we might fly. Open the heart. Take it. It sure is. We're with you, yogis. Go. Take it back. Trust. Give and receive. Here for three. Don't miss it. The last two. You got it. And one. Stand tall. Release. And hug someone. You guessed it. You guessed it. Get to some different people. Get up off your mat. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Man. So glad you're here, brother. So glad you're here. Mm. Someone get to Sarah back there. Get to Sarah. She's working hard for you. Yeah. Someone else get to Sarah. Turn around and give that girl a hug. You can't get enough of that, yogis, I promise you. Mountain pose when you're ready. Let a little wave come in like you're at a Baptist revival. Yeah. Breathe in. And out. Take in. Back bend. Give it back. Open the heart. Offer. Reach high. And fold low. Touch the toes. Or get closer. Halfway lift. Crow pose. This moment's yours. Take it. Make it your own. Yeah. You know what to do. So do. Yes. 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 Love the attempts. Falling is a necessary step you must take before flying. Meet us back upward and downward facing dog. Three breaths to seal in our standing practice. In. 
and out. I take it and offer ha. Inhale and celebrate. Go hinge forward. The high plank. Remember high plank so long ago? Remember that in the beginning? It was like, oh, this is awful. And now it's like, oh, this is awesome. Yes. What's changed? Lower slowly all the way to the belly. The only thing that's changed is what's in between our ears, our perception of reality. We make a grave mistake when we suppose ourselves to end at our skin. We make a grave mistake when we suppose ourselves to be separate in any way from the environment around us, and that includes every person and every living thing and every inanimate object in it. We make a grave mistake when we think it's raining on only our house. We forget Even if we don't necessarily need our neighbors, they may need us to offer a kind ear, gently switch sides, to offer a kind smile. It takes so little to make the immediate environment around us so much better. Some movement, some breathing to fill our cup steps so that we might be balanced, opening the heart, offering up. Simple, sustainable steps. Great service. Bring the hands underneath the shoulders, please. Press up to a tabletop. Then lie down onto your back with the feet facing forward. Even you front rowers. That's been fun to have you today. Come into bridge pose. Soles of the feet flat, hips high. Don't just blindly follow your neighbor. There is no guarantee they have any idea what they are doing. We must at some point look inside and see what's right for us. It's called integrity. Just look inside and see what's right for us and then do. That's called activism. Recycle. Use a hanky walk once in a while. There are easy steps we can take to start to reduce our footprint, the shadow we cast on the environment. Release, allow the knees to knock together, close the eyes, place a hand on the heart, hand on the belly. Look inside. Consider just one action that you could take for your internal environment. Maybe you can start juicing. Maybe you can start eating a vegetable once in a while. See whatever that choice is for you. Come into bridge pose or wheel. Offer this effort right here, this energy, this moment right now, to that commitment. For wheel, plant the hands next to the ears, fingers facing the same direction as the toes. Come to the crown of the head then press up straight in the arm. Whatever wise choice you make for you, whatever wise choice you have brewing inside of you, right here, open the mouth, stick out the tongue, cross the eyes, and roar like a lion. Go, rawr! Again, go, And again, go, Release and go, ha. Knock the knees together. Place a hand on the belly. Hand on the heart. Close the eyes. Go inside. Where the source of your wisdom lies. Go inside and see one step you could take for the external environment, for that which is outside. 
for that choice. When you see it, bridge or wheel, choose it and offer this moment to that choice. Press up, come up, and God damn it, don't wait. That's it, get it out. Make it great. Take it, yogis. This moment is yours for three. For two. Last one, go. Release and go. Woo! Hug the knees like you love the knees. Breathe in and go. Woo! Wow. Little rock side to side. Come into dead bug pose by capturing the soles of the feet with the hand. Pull down gently so you feel the rest of the spine iron out. I like that a lot. And if you're avoiding colliding with the person next to you, ask yourself, why still? Why still avoid? Reach over. A little high foot five for your neighbor. You already got a lot of them on you, yogis. A little foot fungus ain't going to kill you. But you never know when that little simple connection can be so brilliant for someone. Release by hugging the knees into the chest. Keep the right leg as you extend the left leg long to the mat. Take a moment to bash over a water bottle. <laughs> and then guide the leg across the body for supine twist. It's silly the things that embarrass us in yoga class. Oh shit, I bashed over a water bottle. Fuck, I must be a bad yogi. You're not bad. You just momentarily forgot where that water bottle was in space and time. And isn't that a silly thing to think you're the least bit bad over? If I said, hey, where's that water bottle I gave you that one time? Where is it now? You go, it's in my kitchen, but I'm not sure exactly where. And I went, you're bad. You wouldn't think that. You ever farted in yoga class? Ah. Hey, there you go. We got one. Guide the leg back across the body. Give the knees a big squeeze, please. Hug them like you love them. Don't just grab them, huh? Hug them like you really love them. Take a moment to be grateful for them. I don't have bad knees. I have meniscus like Swiss cheese. That's the, that's the logical, rational fact. They're not bad because of that. When you're ready, switch sides. I need to take that moment every once in a while to be grateful for myself, my body, the people around me. That's grace. That's being graceful. Whatever it is for you, it could be taking a moment for a meal, it could be sending a text to someone long forgotten. It manifests itself in so many ways, being of gratitude. Even if it just starts in the most important part between your ears, just thinking gratitude has a measurable scientific effect on the psyche, on the body. of one person, place, or thing you're grateful for, and see if a subtle smile creeps onto their face along with that thought. <clears throat> when you feel even and complete, guide the leg back across the body, give the knees another big hug up into the chest, really wrap them up tight, they've done so much for you today. And then release to Shavasana. And before you scoot, just know I'm going to have you collide hands with the person next to you. So you'll just have to scoot back. So just stay where you are. Get comfy. And then let the palms roll open to the sky. This doesn't have to be weird. Just tell them I made you do it. It's okay. Reach out. Don't necessarily interlace fingers with the person at your side. That will get creepy fast. Just make a, a contact of some sort. Enough so that you feel, I see you in the back, don't do that. 
I see you. <laughs> Just so much that as you start to settle and sink deeper and deeper, you start to feel less and less of a separateness between you and the people next to you. See if as you let your presence travel down, down, down to the hands or fingers that are touching the person next to you. See if the skin and the barriers start to melt away. Replace instead with a subtle pulsation, an energy real traveling back and forth across a continuum. A great and powerful human circuit board that when united is powerful beyond compare. That when unafraid to be brilliant, to shine and light the way for others, it's inspiring. afraid to offer your brightest, to believe in yourself. We need exactly this. you down you got a light so bright you can turn it around don't let life get you down you got a light so bright you can turn it around huh? Some problems I know they will pass. And this moment will not last. You've got to open your heart to what comes next. Ah. Slowly start to invite your awareness and presence from back inside your own skin. Gently moving your hands away from that brilliant connection, providing deep breaths into your wrists and ankles along with subtle movements. As you're ready, Reaching and stretching your arms up high overhead, biceps by the ears. When you're ready, roll onto your right side. Curl it nice and tight here.
take a moment to look inside and a moment to remember that and those qualities which make you great, amazing, and valuable member of this ever-changing human chain. When you're ready to accept the responsibility that comes with that great power, press up to a comfortable seat. We'll seal our hour together by singing three ohms as one community. <clears throat> Take a moment to sit up tall and proud. You've earned this, Yogi. Set your hands deliberately. First, a full round of breath. In and out. Three times as one. Take in. Oh. to the forehead, exhale the forehead to the earth with the chin to the chest, moment of gratitude, looks good on all of us, even the best, thank you so much yogis for coming out today, for helping to make this place so full of energy, for sharing that with everybody and me, it's an honor to be here as your guide and a joy to be part of this community, namaste. namaste. Wow, well done, guys. Well done. Well done. How about for Megan and Sarah?